air signs, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, welcome to my channel, this is Chelsea, thank you so much for liking and subscribing, I really appreciate your love and support, and this reading, for those of you single and looking, we are going to find out what's coming towards you in love by the end of 2022, um, and please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you, spirits and angels, please show me for air signs, Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, single air signs gemini libra and aquarius <laughs> what's coming up in love for air signs by the end of 2022 love love queen of cups someone is coming in or that you're going to fall in love with somebody. Somebody is going to fall in love with you. Six of Cups at the bottom of the deck. And also got a Judgment here. So... By the end of 2022, I feel like there will be a visitation from someone from your past. Someone is going to want to hash things out. Someone that you may not have put in any more effort into that connection, into that person. This person is, is going to return and try to... I think that they're going to say something to you, okay? Um, also, another thing I'm seeing here is that with the Queen of Cups here, it feels like also at the Judgment, some of you are going to see someone perhaps you have been romantically connected with in the past, receiving their karma, okay? Uh, bad karma. Um, and I feel like with the Five of Cups here, you may see them being disappointed or breaking up with someone else or being broken up with. Um, with the justice here in my verse, you may witness like a separation. This separation, you, you're already separated from this person, but you're going to watch them or hear something about an ex, someone you or anybody you've been romantically connected with in the past, that they are divorced or getting a divorce, separated. And I feel like with the Three of Cups, <laughs> I hate to say this, you're going to feel like you're going to rejoice uh, by, hear from hearing, by, hearing from, by hearing that news, okay? Because it feels like with the uh, Five of Cups here, it's like someone is in despair and disappointed. And judgment, it's like, it feels a bit like someone is going to tell you this or that you're going to find out yourself, okay? Um, that this person with the other person's connection it looked promising but it just something something happened something will happen okay so you may witness a separation or, div or a divorce um, or hear something like that in regards to a past person um, with a third party okay through a cups especially if also for some of you if you're involved in the third party situation, I'm also sensing that you may hear some news in regards of your person separating from the third party, okay? And I feel like, again, through Cups here, you're gonna feel kind of happy <laughs> about knowing about knowing that or about hearing that news. You're gonna be happy about it. Nine of Cups here as well. It feels like it's your, it's a wishful, it's a wishful, I'm not talking right today. <laughs> Sorry about that. Nine of Cups, it's like, you're going to be happy about it. And also, this could be could have been your wish, right? To, to find out, to know, to know or to see that this person is separating from the other person. If this is a third party situation. I don't know why I can't talk today, but <laughs> sorry about that. We've got the Nine of Wands and then we've got the Devil here in my verse. Yep, yeah, release someone you're gonna hear that someone is gonna release themselves from the third party and this is somebody you're romantically linked to right now or in the past okay that's what i'm getting here but i feel like this person is gonna break up or separate with the other person and then will come to you 
Six of Cups and the Judgment. They're going to come to you and they're going to tell you. Maybe they, they, maybe you're going to hear it from the horse's mouth, okay? That means from the person himself or herself. Let's see more. <laughs> Don't know why you're reading. I, ah, oh, maybe the Two of Swords and the Page of Wands here. I feel like you're going to be left speechless. That's that's what it is. I feel like you're going to be kind of speechless when you hear that. You're going to be like, what? <laughs> I cannot believe this. But this is also something that maybe is going to make you happy. Or oh, that this is something that you would like to hear. To you, it's good news. To them, it's bad news. Okay? So we've got the Queen of Wands. You see? For those of you, again, in a third party situation, I see um, someone choosing to let go of the third party because two of swords can indicate a choice, right? And then also we've got the page of wands here. Another thing I'm getting here is you are going to have someone from your past visiting you, sending you a message or trying to call you. Some of you are going to say, no, I don't want to talk to you at all. And they're going to be very disappointed here with the five of cups. And then you're going to kind of feel good about them reaching out to you and you rejecting them right maybe this person has lied to you or cheated on you or had some issues or the connection could have been very toxic right and with the nine of wands feels like this is someone you may have your guards up and they have already hurt you in the past so this person may also express to you their love for you may try to remind you of the past the good times and all of that and this person maybe you haven't been speaking with in a while they're gonna return okay um on the other hand um for some of you it feels like six of cups can indicate like a soulmate connection right some of you you might be meeting a soulmate if this is a soulmate connection this person could be a divorcee okay single and divorced but available i feel like you're not going to be you're not gonna decide right away you may feel kind of indecisive in regards to choosing or choosing to want to be with this person because it feels like this person either comes with children some baggages from the past okay could be divorced or may have children that's just for some of you and we've got the eight of swords here and reverse and with the judgment five of cups i feel i see you either are gonna reject this person because of their background because of maybe they have children um or some of you may be indecisive. You may make this person wait um, until you make a decision to you until you make a decision to whether to accept this person or not. Okay, I feel like this person will have to put in a lot of work in order to get your attention. They may shower you with gifts, with um, also sweet talks. <laughs> passionate conversations I'm seeing you with the page of wands some of you meet this person on social media or dating apps or while you're socializing partying uh, could be through friends as well and the devil here is in our first yep this part is super specific so if, if it doesn't resonate maybe this is gonna happen uh, by the end of this year yep see nine of pentacles here is in reverse uh, for those of you single, you're not going to be single anymore by the end of this year. But don't take the timing too literally, okay? Divine timing <clears throat> for each and every one of you is different. So give and take. Um, the world here is in reverse and we've got the lovers. Yeah, I feel like a choice will be made. Two cards that indicates choice. So some of you may have two options, right? Whether to stay with someone or to give this someone from your past a chance or to give a new person a chance hmm yeah so you are going to try and choose whether to you know six of cups it feels like there's some sentimental value with someone from your past you don't know i feel like you're gonna try and decide whether to return or accept a reconciliation offer from someone from your past or to actually choose another person because there is another person here okay um and again i see this new person whom comes with children or could be a divorcee this person is coming in okay 
and I feel like you're gonna take some time. This person will have to put in a lot of effort, Eight of Pentacles in reverse, before they can win your heart. Six of Wands in reverse. Feels like you're not gonna be interested, at least in the beginning. Um, but eventually, I feel like it's your choice to sort in the lovers here. It's gonna be your choice whether you're gonna, um, again, choose this new person or this past person or to stick to this past person. Mm, I mean, to give this person a second chance. All right, can't even talk today. But anyway, Air Science, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. This is your reading. I hope you resonate in some way, shape, or form. Um, open for personal readings. If you like to book me, my information is in the description box below. And also, don't forget to hit like, share, and subscribe. And um, I'm going to leave you with two playlists on the screen right now. The first one is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Check it out if you want to. And the second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different... different um, questions see i can't talk <laughs> i don't know something's gonna leave you speechless by the end of this year but i don't think it's bad i i just think you're just going to have to decide again to sort you or that you may just not want to decide that quickly yeah all right air signs take care hope to see you back here again soon bye